Hello, life forms. It is I, Bonsai, and this is episode 20 of my Ghost of Tsushima campaign. Last time we left off, we rescued Jen's uncle, but now we got a new problem. The Mongols have taken various villages that are producing food. They are trying to starve us out. So I am having to deploy the Southern Strategy 2.0 in order to correct that problem. We have to recapture all these different villages and all these farmsteads in order to be able to survive the winter because if we don't, the Mongols are going to starve us out. We're going to try and work our way forward north and there are other resistance groups scattered all over the northern half of the island and we're going to try and combine them with our own forces along with help from the Shogunate from the mainland and hopefully that will be enough to get us a big enough army to drive the Mongols back into the sea where they belong. But for right now we have to take back our home one village at a time. <laughs> that was my dog. She was just curling up on the couch. Such a sweet thing. Let's see. Alright, rescue hostages. Kill enemies who are on fire. Um... Okay. Oh yeah, that's another thing that I've noticed. The enemies that I'm facing now, they're they got more armor on them. They are much better armored than most of the previous enemies that I've encountered. And apparently they got eagles with them. I don't know how many there are, but...
those eagles are all over the place. Please tell me those are seagulls. Some shong in a ship or some, you malak now. Don't you say that? See, how many of them are there? All right, I need intel. Fortunately, I do have my handy dandy listening ability. Might be able to sneak around like this. I might. I don't think I'm going to be able to kill that many enemies while they're on fire. Eagles, eagles, eagles. Those are going to be the bane of my existence from this point forward. Oh yeah, supplies. I'm forever indebted to you. Be careful up there. All right, are there any more eagles? I think I might be able to get a bunch of them to run into this grass and get themselves caught on fire. Let's see, how many of them do I need to do that? Four. Okay, do I need to kill them while they're on fire, or do I need to kill them with fire?
Okay, somebody's going to hear if he gets killed, so... I chain assassinate these two. I think I can. If he gets close enough, I can probably kill both of these at once. Probably. Yeah, flaming arrows. Okay, good. Alright, I'm going to wait for him to get back up close to the porch. day of your life? Wow, you must live a pretty crappy life, dude. <laughs> because you have not been having super fun times, let me tell you. Okay, somebody's got some gingivitis, or they got a hernia, or I have no idea. This is a lot harder than it looks. Okay, so it is, uh, I do have to eliminate them by setting them on fire. Good. Oh, that one was close by. That's two. Ooh. 
Light one up. Missed. Some pedalists <laughs> Okay, they stay close together now. That's four. And how much back? And how much are that? Quit whining. You saved us. Did they find your key to Kosaku's arm? <laughs> they could have the key for all I care. Kosaku is a hero from a children's story. You don't believe the armor exists? Not at all. Take our key and see for yourself, my lord. Key of Eo. One of six keys said to lead to Gosaku's armor, gifted by the farmers of Eel Village. Six keys. Liberate Eel Village. Done. Completed bonus objectives as well. Whew. That was... That was intense. Eight steel. Yes, thank you. And some additional supplies. I'm just gonna run through all these buildings, see if there's anything else worth taking. And then I'm gonna move on. I need more iron is what I need, so I think I'll tackle a couple of them that'll give me iron instead. I wonder if I go further north, I'll start seeing snow. That'd be pretty cool. Bamboo. I can always use more bamboo. Let's see. Nothing here, nothing there. What about this little stable? Nope. 
nothing. Now this gives ammo of all types. Explosive arrows, but no fire arrows. I spent so many fire arrows doing that. They just would never get close to the torches. If they did that, that would have been so much easier. I could have just plunk the torches and set them on fire. Let's see. Okay, the map. Okay, wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five, six. So all six of these together will probably give me what I, the keys that I need. We just need to keep going and tackle them one village at a time. Fast travel here. Well, at least I know they got eagles now. Yeah, yeah, I, I know. So nice of you to say. Ohama, Ohama Fishing Village. Maybe these people can get inside the village after I'm done liberating it. But kill an enemy with a Shoji assassination. Okay, Shoji assassination is where you stab them through these uh, rice paper doors. And if that's the only bonus objective, this could be easier than I thought. Rescue hostages. That was close. Alright, that was risky, but it was worth it. Okay, possibly not as easy as I originally thought. to move when you did.
Shit, you had a helmet. Damn it! Okay, I got the right one. Shit, 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 shit. Adopt a more pragmatic approach. I said it myself, these guys are better armor than the ones I'm used to fighting. These guys, a lot of them are wearing helmets, and that just makes things even more difficult. got dogs. Okay. This isn't working. We need to use the Ronin attire for now. 
some this place in your home. Use this place. I don't think I can do that bonus objective. Did I kill the dog? No, I didn't kill the dog. Okay, good. All it required was a little ingenuity, and I figured it out. Okay, that guy's an archer. He he can spot me easily. He's got very good eyes, very good vision. And there's the two dogs. Those two other goons. That didn't kill either one of them? Damn! Tough motherfuckers, aren't you? Remember you. You're safe now. Yeah, well, remember me somewhere else. This place is dangerous, in case you haven't noticed. Darn, even the archers are heavily armored.
Oh, that guy's got a very short patrol route. There doesn't seem to be any eagles. And I don't see any dogs either. So this one might be a little bit easier. some cover. That's what I was trying to do. What still? Nice hat. Seek the armor of a hero named Gosaku. Please take this key to it. You deserve to wear it. I won't let the Mongols come near Gosaku's legacy. Okay, that's two of six. Interesting. Does it look different than the other ones? Eh, it's the same. Alright, they all look the same. Well, that's unfortunate. I was hoping that there would be some difference between the keys. <clears throat> no! <laughs> yes, he is. He's the best. Nobu is best boy. Probably seeing me running around like this and I'm like, what the hell is he doing? Does anybody else think that the smoke bombs kind of look like, um, well, well, y you know what I'm getting at. Also, creeping around underneath those crawl spaces would have been a pretty clever idea, too, but... Okay, Sana, Sana, I didn't think about it. We're just going to sweep this place real fast, and then... We're going to move on to the next one. Yeah, baby. A samurai. What you got to say about that? My lord, My lord. straw hat women have been attacking travelers in Kubara. More of Nuzo's treacherous men spilling innocent blood. 
working with the Mongols. I have family near the inn near Akashima Coast, my lord. I hope they're safe. I'll find the inn and deal with these traitors. Alright, good. New location. A final request. Mongols and bandits are bad enough, but groups of rogue straw hat ronin have become more bold. I have heard they're attacking peasants in Kubora. I must stop them. Yeah, that'd be nice. Natal. What is Natal? So many of these will give me silk. I don't really need silk, I need gold. Gold, iron, and steel are my two biggest priority, my three biggest priorities right now. Three! Okay, I think I picked this place clean. Crabs. That sounds good right about now. I wouldn't mind having crab. Seafood just in general sounds good right about now. Maybe I'll take mom out for seafood for mama's day. Oh boy. Where to next? Here's a good one. It's near the Adachi estate, too. Hmm. Eight more steel. So I'm guessing 12 iron, 8 steel, and another 12 iron. Let's see. Yeah, once I sweep all these, I should have just enough to upgrade my sword again. And it really needs it, let me tell you. This rickety old thing can barely cut butter. I'm exaggerating, of course, but even so, I'd like a stronger sword, is what I'm trying to say. All right, leave Nobu out here, and then I'll get closer to the town. Rescue hostages. Kill enemies without healing. Smoke bombs are stored. Damn. All right, let's see. Okay, I think if I use stealth, I can, I can probably perform that one.
Chicago. Chicago. Well, that was close. A huge fish. Where is he going? If I slide down, I'll be right next to him. Swing. That's two. Oh yeah, these guys are all over the place. Any which way but loose and any which way you can. Hostages killed. Yep. Well, I didn't expect they'd all be alerted. Three smoke bombs. These guys are lightweight armored. Didn't expect that.
Okay, five. There are five on high alert now. I got you, baby. You'll be free soon. Well, that was sloppy, but it worked. Be careful out there. I'm surprised she looks at me and she's not terrified. With this mask on. I'd be more than a little intimidated myself. Almost made a huge mistake just then. And that's... Oh man, come back! That just made things significantly more difficult. But anyway, I completed the bonus objective, so... Yeah, I'll, I'll stick with that for right now. Alright, where's that archer? There he is. Gosh, you bastard. What the heck? Did he flip and land back on the roof? Editor's mistake in my favor, I guess. See, good. Woman, don't start with me. Calm 
down, pimp. Calm down. Lord Sakai, you have my things. You're safe now. Alright, because I had to start over, does that mean I fail the bonus objective? Am I still going to get it? Good night, sweet prince. Well, you're the last one, aren't you? clever way to enter. Have you ever seen the armor yourself? We'd never dare look, my lord. We were to keep it safe for someone like you. If you say so. Two more ability points. Whatever shall I spend them on? <laughs> I like that. Eight steel. All right. I'm on my way. Steel is going to be easy to find. So is gold, but iron... That's going to be a major pain in the left one. <laughs> Poor Nobu. Let's see, do I? Nope, don't need any more chimes. Shrine of some sort, but it's been toppled. That is a shame. 
right, these villages don't really have all that many supplies or items to filch, so... You know what, I'm just gonna move on ahead. I'm not gonna waste my time running around here. I'm sure I can find supplies and linen elsewhere. Traveler's attire. Let's just go around these buildings and see if there's any Mongol artifacts that I missed. Well, at least somebody put the fire out. That's good. Huh? I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, Snowball is best boy. Let's go, let's go. When chimes are full. Okay, nothing here. All right, we've established that one. There's another one over here. Iron. That'll bring me up to 74. That gives me more steel. That'll put me over the top for 84. Then I can upgrade my sword again. And it looks like I've almost completely cleared out this half of the island. Well, it's a third of the island anyway. Anyway, there's something I want to check out at this cemetery, but for right now, I'm going to have to call it a night. Thank you, everybody, for coming by and watching my playthrough of Ghost of Tsushima. It's been an honor and a privilege to be your storyteller tonight. If you like what you've seen so far, you can catch the rest of Jen Sakai's journey at my YouTube page. It's Bonsai 0311, same as it is on Twitch and on my YouTube. PlayStation Network account. And we will be picking this up again tomorrow night at 7 o'clock Central Time. Until then, like, like, subscribe, do the whole social thing. And as always, I will see you in the next playthrough. Later.